Hello, G Connors. Today, I am going to be showing you our newly added custom reports for both QBO and Zero. So starting with Zero, I'm going to show you where to find them, and then I'm going to get through what they look like and feel like as reports. So going to GECon for Zero, uh, get accounting data reports, and then our custom reports here. Waiting for this window to load up for us. All right, so heading into our dropdown, to start, we have our new aged payables by contact groups and then aged payables detail in the customer currency. We also have our aged receivables in the customer currency and then our aged receivables by contact groups. In addition to that, we have a couple new budget reports as well, our budget variance by tracking category, and then our budget versus actuals by tracking category. So let's go ahead and see what these reports look like and what they can do for you. Starting here with the aged payables detail by contact groups, this report allows users to view detailed info about aged payables categorized by contact groups, helps better understand and manage payables related to different contact groups or suppliers. And this is what that report is going to look like for you. Moving on over to our age payables details in the customer currency, this report provides info on age payables in the customer's currency, which is particularly useful for businesses dealing with international transactions and multiple currencies. Moving on down, we have our age receivables detail in the customer currency. Similar to the age payables report, this report displays aged receivables in the customer's currency, facilitating better management of receivables in a multi-currency context. Moving on over to our aged receivables detail by contact group, this report provides a breakdown of outstanding receivables based on the groups or categories to which your customers or clients belong. It helps you better understand who owes you money and in what categories, making it easier to manage and prioritize collections efforts, and maintain healthy cash flow. This report is valuable for businesses that want to segment their accounts receivable data to improve their receivables management. Moving on down to our budget reports, we have our budget variance by tracking category. So this report allows for a comparison of budgeted amounts and actual expenses, categorized by tracking categories. It helps in tracking budget adherence and identifying areas where there are variances. Moving on down to our budget versus actuals by tracking category, this report provides a more detailed breakdown of budgeted amounts versus actual expenditures segmented by tracking categories. It supports an in-depth analysis of budget performance for different aspects of the business. So these are our new custom accounting reports for zero. Moving on over to QuickBooks, we've got two new reports here for you, and I'll show you right where to find them. Going to GACon for QuickBooks, get accounting data reports, and our custom accounting reports. Letting this window load up for us. The two new reports that we have for you guys here are our cash transactions report, and then our project profitability, profitability summary report. Let's get into what these look like and what they can do for you. So as you can see here, I've got our cash transactions report. So this is now easily generates a profit and loss reports with a comparison feature, allowing for a side-by-side -side analysis of different classes or categories. This enhances financial analysis and decision-making by providing a clearer view of the performance of various segments. Moving on over to our project profitability summary here, historical view reports have been introduced, enabling users to track and compare financial data over time. This feature allows for a more comprehensive understanding of financial trends, helping businesses make informed decisions based on historical performance. That's the general overview of our new custom accounting reports for you guys in both Zero and QBO. Please let us know what you think and what else you'd like added. Uh, make sure to like, 
comment, and follow for more. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.